It really did shatter my world. It shattered everything. And I didn't even realize how much it shattered just because I was. I was in pieces. I think that's when, you know, I started really um, experimenting with sex and pain and, and even humiliation. Sex doesn't feel right if it's not destroying me. It makes sense to me now in order to do the suspension scene today. You're going to put up a wall where you're like, I can't do this uh -huh. because you're human. Okay. <laughs> and once you're airborne, like a few, just usually a few seconds after you're airborne, um, that's when your mind, mind is going to kick in and your chemicals are going to kick in, the adrenaline, the endorphins, uh -huh. dopamine, all that good stuff yes. is going to come. Okay. And that's when spiritual fun begins. All right. And you can just kind of ride the wave. You're just gonna feel a little prick. I'm just setting the needle down. Okay. To just release myself and surrender myself to the sensations that my body was feeding my brain. That's kind of like what I try to do with sex is, you know, try to take the mind out of it, responding solely to the nervous system and uh, challenging it. It's gonna hit you like a ton of bricks. It is, isn't it? It is, but then it's all good. It's all After good. the ton of bricks, it's all good. Okay, go into the bricks. Okay, I'm good. All right, all right. Oh, oh, oh. There really is more to this profession than spreading your legs, having a stranger do their business on you, and taking the money. What I do is make a connection with people that don't usually have that connection anywhere else. And then when they leave me, they, they feel something different.